Welcome back. This is Baishu's Chinese language learning program. Last time we talked about one of the pronunciation of this character, Le. Today we, are, we will talk about the second pronunciation of this character, Liao. Okay, let's see the first usage of Liao. Okay, the first one, Liao is used as a verb. As a verb, first mean is understand. For example, 一目了然 一目了然 一 means one, a 目 means look, glance, 了然 means understand. For example, 贫富之间的巨大差距一目了然贫富之间的巨大差距一目了然贫 means poor, 富 means rich, 之间 means between, 巨大 means vast, big, giant, 差距 means gap, difference, 一目了然 means very clear, it's very obvious. Another example is Liao Jie. Liao means no. Jie also means no or understand. For example, Ta Liao Jie Zi de Ruo Dian. Ta Liao Jie Zi de Ruo Dian. Ta means she. Liao Jie means no. Zi Ji de her. Ruo Dian means weakness. Okay, Liao as a verb, the second meaning is end or finish. For example, Liao Jie. Liao means finish. Jie also means finish. For example, 这最后一笔付款将了结你欠我的债务。这最后一笔付款将了结你欠我的债务。means this. 最后 means last. 一笔 means one or a. 付款 means payment. 将 means will. 了结 means finish, settle or end. Or wipe out. 你 means you. 欠 means owe. O W E. 我的 means my. 债务 debt. Okay. 了 is used as a adverb. The first Use as a adverb is to be placed after a verb as a complement with the or bu to indicate the possibility of something. For example, shan bu liao. Shan bu liao. Shan means delete. Bu liao means it is impossible. Means cannot, cannot delete. It means it is impossible to delete it. Another example, 你来得了,来不了? 你来得了,来不了? means is that possible you can come or not? The answer is 来得了 means it is possible I can come. Okay, as a adverb, the second usage is to be placed before or after the end Buddha to indicate some serious situation. For example, Na Hai Liao De Na Hai Liao De Na Z Terrible Buddha Liao Buddha Liao also means terrible. Horrible, very, extremely. For example, 这儿冷得不得了。这儿冷得不得了。这儿, here, 冷, means cold, 不得了, very, extremely. Another example is, 他听到那坏消息伤心得不得了。
他 means she, 听到 hurt, not that, 坏 bad, 消息 news, 伤心 sad, heartbroken, 不得了 very. Okay, today's idiom is 雪中送炭。雪中送炭。雪 means snow. 中 means in the middle of something. 送 means send. Offer. 炭 means charcoal. This means send charcoal in snowy weather. For example, 对该公司来说，这笔钱真可谓是雪中送炭。哦，你的帮助真是雪中送炭。Okay, let's see this sentence again. 对该公司来说，这笔钱真可谓是雪中送炭。对 ，to 该 this 公司 means company 来说，嗯、um, ，is to this company for this company. Okay, 这 means this. 笔钱，这笔 means this， 钱 means money， 真 means really， 可谓 is。This 是 also is。雪中送炭 is very timely help。Okay， that is all for today。谢谢，下次见了。